This year's theme is Make a Healthy Splash. Share the fun, not the germs. May 18th to the 24th, 2015, is a chance to celebrate Mason County's natural landscape and learn about the role that swimmers, beach staff, pool owners, and public health officials all have in helping to prevent drowning, pool chemical injuries, and outbreaks of rec recreational water illnesses. As a swimmer, there are easy ways that we can actively help keep ourselves safe, protect other swimmers, and reduce the risk of drowning. First, you can prepare by making sure that everyone knows how to swim and that other children, older children and adults know CPR. When we're in the water, keep swimmers safe by using properly fitted life jackets for younger or weaker swimmers, providing continuous supervision close to swimmers, and avoiding alcohol and other drug when swimming or supervising swimmers. When we're not in the water, we can prevent access to the water by installing and maintaining barriers for pools, particularly, and weight-bearing covers, and using locks or alarms for windows and doors. Recreational water illnesses are caused by germs spread by having contact with contaminated water and swimming pools, hot tubs, water parks, lakes, and oceans. Recreational water illnesses can also be caused by chemicals in the water or chemicals that evaporate from the water causing indoor air quality problems. The most common recreational water illness is diarrhea and can be caused by germs like Giardia, Neurovirus, and E. coli. As a swimmer, there are also easy ways that we can help reduce the spread of RWIs. Don't swim when you have diarrhea as this can spread germs in the water and make others sick. Don't swallow pool water and avoid getting water from pools or natural sources in your mouth. Practice good hygiene. Shower with soap before swimming. Wash your hands after using the toilet or changing diapers as germs on your body end up in the water. And parents of young children should remember to wash their children before swimming, check diapers every 30 to 60 minutes, and change diapers in a bathroom or diaper changing area instead of by the water, and take kids to the bathroom every 30 to 60 minutes. So with warm, water, with warm weather coming quickly, Healthy and Safe Swimming Week is a chance to learn how we can all do our part to ensure our community has a safe, healthy, and fun summer. By keeping these tips in mind, we can all be sure to enjoy some of the best summer activities that Mason County has to offer.